have a good number of free school meal, but also send children. And we actually found that it was growing in numbers each time we did a week. Theatre is a big community thing. And especially here at Echo, we are a community theatre company anyway. During these big Norfolk days, we've been able to welcome kids who don't do theatre normally into our Echo family. It's just so lovely to be part of amazing things like this, amazing workshops and all of the shows that we do. Just bringing theatre to young people, regardless of their educational background, social background, making theatre available for all. It's just so much fun and it's so lovely to see them all at the end of the day, show their parents and guardians and what they've been up to and what they've done and go home and perform more in their living rooms. So it's so lovely to be part of. They've actually grown and some of them have joined our groups for shows and things like that and really gone on further. And I think it's something that just helps a great deal because not only is it getting them active and on their feet, but it's also giving them like confidence to just explore their own ideas and, and what they would like to do. My son's a lot more experimentative with food now. It's had a definite impact on what he's eating and what he's thinking about to do with food and healthy eating. I think it's something that we always try and instill in our children at home, but it's very different having it spoken about in a setting of something that's really fun. They're exercising without realising it and also they're reinforcing that message. No, it really, really does help. To be able to have a big pot from half has just been able to branch it out from not one kid but to a hundred. I mean in some holidays sometimes we reach up to 200 individual children which is just amazing. Whether you're on the stage or supporting a theatre production backstage it's a it's a massive team effort so being part of that for any young people it teaches them about that group work and making choices and working on their own initiative. Without the funding as a volunteer organisation, we would just not be able to, to resource it and be able to provide those opportunities. It also has allowed us to get really good practitioners on board that are really teaching the kids something and really being able to provide a safe space and a caring environment, especially for the SEND children, where we are able to get in actual one-to-ones, which is just something that we couldn't have done without the half funding. Yeah.